Hello everybody, this is Oliver from NEO and today I want to talk about the QSU and what is actually the advantage of having a QSU in your home. So, when we uh, just look at the QSU, how it is done already, it's a very simple teapot and what you have here is that you actually have a strainer so you have some teapots which have a built-in strainer out of metal and some they have just normal clay holes in it but um, the difference finally is um, that um, especially the clay holes they are sometimes a little bit difficult to use for Fukamushi which is a deep steam tea which can have a little bit nearly dusty like um, dusty like leaves so finally you have to choose for yourself if you want to have a really fine strainer then go more for a metal strainer and if you want to have a strainer which is a little bit more natural also no and you have no um, iron in it then you should go for a naturally built-in clay strainer but what is the main difference between having a QSO and why should you have in the long run when you go into Japanese green tea consider once buying a QSO is that the other uh, especially the other ways of doing green tea they cannot develop the taste as, as, as good as the QSO for example if we have just the normal strainer so here uh, we have uh, the strainer and we compare it with the QSO. What you immediately recognize is that actually the leaves have much more space in the QSU than in the strainer. So when you put the leaves in, they can open up to in a certain way and as more as the leaves can open up, the more flavor they can give to the tea. So finally, it's always a good idea to give them as much space as possible. That's why the QSU is a really good way to give them the whole space and that's how they can develop the most taste. Also in comparison to the on-the-go uh, most known thing which is the tea bag. Tea bag is actually in terms of giving space to uh, the tea leaves the least variant. It's good if you're on the go and you want to bring your own green tea with you because the green tea you get outside of your house doesn't uh, or isn't as good as you want to have it so you can absolutely bring a green tea uh, or a tea bag and put your green tea inside but what's just a fact is that in the green tea bag actually the size uh, of the tea bag is very limited even more limited than with the strainer so you have to expect and accept as well that you have less flavor and a, a mild of taste profile finally of your tea when you use a tea bag otherwise what is also good about the QSU is actually that you have the possibility to really pour the tea in an easy way the side handle which has been uh, developed about the ninth, uh, the ninth century um, in Japan is what is good about it that you can with your wrist much more control the tea or kind of the pouring of the tea into different cups. What is important when you have different cups about with the tea, so I can show it here to you, just taking this already done tea and just pour it in as an example. You can control much more with your wrist how much water you want to put in the cup and as you're sharing a tea it is important that the tea is in equal way shared between the glasses or uh, the tea cups as the tea which is a little bit lower in the cues is a little bit stronger and the upper water is a little bit, little bit less strong so like this you can really have a fair amount of taste in each glass and the pouring with just the wrist like this is fairly easy and is much more difficult if you have a tea um, if you have a teapot which is with a handle at the back side and additionally it's just the movement which is from a aesthetical standpoint which is also very important in Japan you have much more of a nice way of moving your hand much much less and much less dominant movement of pouring the tea 
in your cup. Good. These are the first and easiest things you have to know about the QSU. So these are three things I wanted to share with you. And uh, if you have any questions about QSU and uh, what you uh, should buy, just ask me. I'll be happy to consult you. And if you ever have another question, don't hesitate to ask me. Bye.